a kind of event film as it marked Shah Rukh Khan's return to the big screen after four long years. Pathan is an ambitious action thriller that plays with the gallery and lives up to the hype. Pathan is overridden in writing but full of power in star style. At first it looks like a Mountain Dew commercial which is slowly but surely gaining traction. The conspiracy followed India's repeal of Article 370, special status for Jammu and Kashmir, and its repercussions for a Pakistani officer who wanted India to pay for this mistake. He turns to the sinister Jim, a former RAW agent who was being persecuted by his own people. He is accompanied by his charming accomplice, Rubai, a former ISI agent, Deepika Padukone, with unclear motives. Pathan, Jim and Rubai have their eyes and ears opened wide as they traverse the continent in a dangerous game of betrayal and revenge. Three races to destroy and protect the world they believe in. Director Siddharth Anand gave his spy thriller the very best treatment. He described it more like a superhero movie that needed a major lifting of disbelief. Its fan interest and adoration for mainstream Hollywood blockbusters like Marvel movies or Tom Cruise's Mission Impossible series to name a few is evident here. Expect Falcon in a wingsuit, exaggerated action and chase scenes, anti-death and anti-gravity action in cars, motorbikes, ice cream and helicopters, immortal heroes and villains talking with squeaky dialogue, a femme fatale and all imbued with ideas. Patriotism. Action trumps emotion for most of the film and this is new territory for SRK, who is especially fond of romantic or conversational roles. It's interesting how at 57 she lets her body speak with those very emotional eyes, like a great action hero. It's presence that keeps average scripts and VFX incomparable. Although the background score is off-scripted, Bashal and Shakar's score manages to capture the heroism and bravery on display. Also, a highlight of Pathon is John Abraham's solid portrayal of Jim. Whether it's a Bane-esque masquerade performance or an action sequence, John threatens and pulls off a classic case where the villain partially overshadows the hero. Deepika Padukone can kick butt and flawlessly play a leggy, dutiful, morally ambiguous agent, but her chemistry with SRK feels underdeveloped. The spark that John SRK's character shared is gone. Dimple Kapadia reigns supreme again, bringing much-needed seriousness and emotional strength to proceedings. They hope the other characters can exude the sincerity of their roles. YRF Spyworld reunites Karen and Arjun. Wink wink. For the iconic boo boo moment when Bai meets Badshaw. If you're willing to forego the sloppiness in dialogue like, you're pretty screwed. Pathon has all the ingredients of Masala Pot, slow paced tracks, iconic battles between good and evil, and most importantly, a fiery sexy Shah Rukh Khan who can pull off a real fight. Great on and off screen. He is still the undisputed king.